But he's like dating Gigi Hadid and my whole mind is blown. JoJo Fletcher is just like the rest of us. Her mind is blown by Tyler Cameron's recent dates with Gigi Hadid. It's crazy. <laughs> So crazy. E.T. caught up with the former bachelorette and her fiance Jordan Rogers at NBC's Television Critics Association summer press tour on Thursday, where they were promoting their new show, Cash Pad. We team up with homeowners, we help them renovate their properties that are a little unconventional, and we turn them into short-term rentals. So I've been doing this for like the last 10 years. When we got together, he started helping me with my renovation. She dragged me into it. Dragged him into it. I didn't it. see that in the fine oh, print. Incredible. Yeah. And they couldn't help but weigh in on Hannah Brown's runner-ups outings with the supermodel. And He's single and ready to mingle. If I was Hannah, would I feel great? Absolutely No, not. I would feel really crappy. And the fact that it's Gigi Hadid, I mean. Good for him, though. They're all, you, they're all hey, single. They're all single. But also, let's remember, she yes, dumped him. Yes, that's true. And so I feel like. So. I feel like he should just do what he wants and makes him happy. She should do what she wants. They're both single. They also dished on how Tyler's dates with Gigi could affect his chance at being the next Bachelor. I feel like on one hand you're like, yeah, maybe because like your Bachelor should be like ready for love, not going on a date with Gigi. But then again, it's like, oh, he went no, on a date with Gigi. I think like, that. He, oh, he's a he's, he's a, a wanted man. man. Yeah. Um, I don't know if it ruins his chance. I think that he's obviously single and he wants to find and meet girls. And listen, he may end up, it may be his soulmate. Gigi may be his soulmate. Can you imagine what that would be? And while things are heating up with Gigi and Tyler, JoJo and Jordan revealed their picks for the next Bachelor. I like Mike and I like Peter. I like Peter. I like Mike and Peter. I like Peter. I think it's time to have a black bachelor. Yes. I think Mike's amazing. I think he is so handsome, and I I would love to see that happen. But I also think Peter is very charming and sweet, and I think people fell in love with him as far as he went. So I would be happy with either one. Yeah. But my, my vote has been Mike for a while. For now, the couple is planning their own nuptials, but don't expect all of Bachelor Nation to get an invite. We'll invite the people that we're close to, um, but no, I wouldn't say it's like a crazy, going to be a crazy big wedding. Probably average. These things are expensive. And yes, they said their piece on the Blake Kalen Paradise drama that has Bachelor Nation split. I think everyone's kind of at fault. I think that like I don't I obviously don't know what's going on. I read like Twitter and I see the stuff. I think that he felt like he was backed into a corner. I feel like he didn't feel like he's accurately presented. I feel he like he got his story out. He got and she and K and, and who knows what the truth is. I mean none of us really know. Right. But I feel like there's a way to go about these situations. It sucks that it has to be so public. It's not it's just stressful. It's anxiety filled.